Hi, I'm Derek Lewandowski, Yankees content creator, podcaster, and fan for over 30 years. And this is NYY Recap. If you're new here, here's a quick look at some of the things I've got on my channel for you. I like to do player profiles, hype videos, original Yankees documentaries about great players or big moments or my favorite Yankees seasons. I also have a weekly podcast, NYY Recaps Podcast, which you can find wherever you get your podcasts. If you're the type of person who likes commentary or just wants to look at my ugly mug, I also plan to do reactions to every game all season, combined with some of my favorite highlights and home run calls. High drive, left field, that ball is gone, see ya! I'll also hop on every once in a while to talk about trade rumors or my favorite prospects. If it's your first time here, go ahead and put a ring on it, hit that subscribe button and the little bell notification so that you can be alerted every time I post a new video. This is a family-friendly channel. I won't be dropping any F-bombs. I'll do my best to educate the viewers. All throughout the 2020 season, I will be creating a documentary that I will release at the end of the season, hopefully capped off by a world championship. We'll see. I'm about to play the first five or six minutes of this documentary for you so you can form your own opinions. If you want to contribute to this documentary, feel free to visit my Patreon page, which is in the description of this video. Without further ado, Here's the first six minutes of Chase for 28. A 1-1. One, one. That's a base hit. And the Yankees have life on base for the fourth time tonight as they're showing. DJ LeMayhew. 0 for 4 in this game, came in hitting 381 in this ALCS. Over the first five, it's outside, ball one. All he's done in a Yankee uniform is hit. Fly ball into right, back at the wall, this ball is... the ninth inning and a roll as Chapman is into the ball game. The Yankees, who are clearly going to be aggressive, are going to go after one of these pitches, but at what level? Would they get into a bidding war for Cole? A California team. He's a California kid. And everybody thinks it's going to be the Dodgers or the Angels, but you never know unless you get in it and see. All right, the breaking news, Garrett Cole. Astros ace agrees to a record-breaking deal with the New York Yankees. I think it makes them the best team in baseball. Ravi, as we know, they have waited for years, hung on to their money, hung on to their prospects, waiting for that big free agent to come along, and this was him. I'm here. <laughs> I've always been here. <laughs> <laughs> the Yankees came to him, showed him some respect with the money. You broke down the financial part of it. So Brett Gardner doesn't have to make a tough decision and say, I, I've got to go somewhere else. He doesn't want to go anywhere else. He's a lifelong Yankee. Now batting for the Yankees, number two, Derek Jeter, number two. I told you five years ago I've been making this call and uh, I, I kept my promise. Thank you, Jack. And, and I didn't know what to expect today, but this is just obviously it's the ultimate honor. It's the highest honor you can get as a player. Dylan Batances. He's one of the most accomplished and dominant relief pitchers in Major League Baseball.
The Major League Baseball cheating scandal sending shockwaves around the world. The owner of the Houston Astros fired the team's general manager and manager after an investigation found that the Astros cheated by stealing signs during their World Series championship season. We've heard reports about Astros players wearing buzzers underneath their uniforms. That's how they're getting the signal, what pitch is coming. I know the commissioner's office looked into this and they determined there was nothing to it. Can you assure us there were no buzzers or anything like that being Well, used? the commissioner, we got investigated for three months and the commissioner's office did as thorough an investigation as anyone could imagine was possible. I mean, I know he mentioned the, the emails and the texts and the messages, um, and I believe them. Sorry, that's not good enough. There's one answer to that. We never use buzzers, ever. Did you use buzzers or not? Been, let's see, on the injured list eight times in seven seasons, different parts of the body with the injuries. Here, we're putting some of them on. Flat. MVP as bets has been swapped. Four teams involve multiple trades here, but let's look at the names and where they go as the Dodgers do get Mookie Betts, David Price. Sox have been looking for a deal, right? They've been shopping about, look, here's what he got. What was it about? This one that made it the one. The sights and sounds every Yankee fan has been waiting to see and hear. Pitchers and catchers hitting the field for the first time as a group. Aaron Boone is beginning his third season as manager, and it's fair to say the pressure Some of the is guys on. coming back from injury. Does that give you enough now to finish what you started last season? Look, we, we feel like we've been a championship caliber team now for a few years. Been knocking on that door, haven't pushed through yet. That one theme, we need to win a world championship. That drive to win is what is what fuels you. It's going to be a really good team, and we're seeing that develop. And I think if you're the Yankees, yes, you're out there trying to make sure this team is ready, all the talent is in place, but you just have to let this team be. This team is going to be really good.